All right, it's 5 a.m. on Friday, April 3rd. Uh, you see all these porta potties? Well, this is the company that I work for. Gotta go now. And uh, I'm actually heading out to work right now. And we have 20 regular sized porta potties. We have four uh, handicap porta potties, also known as ADAs. We have three. Well, I'll take that back. We have four hand wash stations, those portable sinks you see. Uh, my company also does tents. I've put up plenty of tents, but for some reason, they got allied party rentals to do the tent. And, uh, oh, let me see how long is this. It's like over 100 feet long. And, uh, Yep. I would have loved to have put this up myself. And their truck is still sitting there. When I went to bed around midnight, they were just starting to set this tent up. It's, uh, I slept for four hours. And... Now, uh, I'm heading to work. Yeah, I had to get up at four to get ready for work. But that company stole some of the work that my company could have gotten. Uh, this tent's about 20 feet wide and over 100 feet long. Yeah. But anyway. It's my understanding is because the CCMV shelter, which is now in your view, there's going to be a major cleaning in connection to COVID-19. And so people are going to have to leave the building for several hours during the day. And uh, they'll be able to basically hang out in the tent and use those 24 porta potties and hand wash stations. Uh, that's the story I was told anyway. It's not official yet, but it but it makes sense. Uh, so that is why I believe they, that all this stuff was set up. Why my company set up the porta potties and the sinks, and why Allied Party Rentals set up the tent so that the homeless can have somewhere to hang out while the building is going through a major cleaning uh, with some some professional cleaners coming through because normally. We do chores, we take turns. I had to do a chore every 12th day. I actually did a chore last night, but uh, on April 2nd. But that, that said, uh, I gotta go to work. <laughs>